Hey guys, all right, so this, if you've been following my videos, I'm basically opening all the various things that I have ordered to work on my one wheels or modify them or all around anything related to updating, modifying, changing them. And I really wanted to, I know there's all these simple, there are so many simple solutions out there that you do not have to go to this extreme to buy things like this, which is a Bosch professional cordless screwdriver that just fits in the palm of my hand, but it's extremely powerful, sensitive. It also has a unique detection system for slippage so that you do not strip screws. This is, I've actually never owned one of these. I'm about to open it up and I'm about to look at it with you for the first time. Again, this is a Bosch professional cordless screwdriver, 3.6 volt and uh, push and go, which was one of the other things I really like where you just, I guess you apply some pressure and it starts to, and it senses the screw and feels like if it grips it well enough, it will start start pushing it in. And apparently, I mean, these are used for driving. It's an extremely powerful tool, my understanding. So let me uh, open this up. So it's got a little seal on it, a Bosch seal. Uh, oh, I see they got a sticker over here. So I think this is called Bosch Go. I think that might be the short name for it. All right, so they got a Oh, this is really, oh, wow. That's actually in the case, look at that. I didn't, I did not know that it actually came in a really nice portable little case, which is super cool. Let's see if it actually works. Does it actually work? Is it light? Is there something wrong here? That's kind of funny. Like it's, <laughs> it's really, I feel like there's something catching. Am I missing something? Oh, maybe it's the, plastic on this. Oh man, it seems out of alignment. There we go. Okay, so it does work. I was just, something is off though. What am I doing? There we go. Okay, so it does work. Just a little getting familiar with how this case goes, but that's pretty cool. So it's got a little carry case not that you would necessarily need that though. I mean, the whole point is the whole point for me was that it's just so compact. Look at that. And again, I've never, I've never held one of these. I've never seen one in person. Ooh, and this, okay. So this has a grip on it. That is fantastic. It's, it's actually a really, really nice grip. And as you can see, there's a whole bunch of settings as well. So, these are control settings, obviously, you know, if you're putting in light screws and being very gentle, or you have, um, you're really trying to put some... Oh, oh, wow, look at that. So <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. So it, it, it picked up the fact that I had put a little bit of pressure and it just starts going. So, I mean, talk about sensitive. Wow, I barely even touched it. So that's pretty cool. So again, my whole idea with this size, right? I can take this, I can throw it in a backpack and if I need to repair something or take a part off or whatever, um, something that involves just minimizing the amount of energy that I have to use out on a trail or out somewhere, I can bring this with me and it's super, super simple. The other nice part about it is, well, okay, it comes with a, a charger it's got the plug in on the back. Just plug that in, you can charge it. It also comes with uh, two screw bits and they say impact on them. So I guess there's some type of impact bit. And these are Bosch, Bosch bits, which are really, really good quality from my experience. I've always had great quality with Bosch products. That's probably why I wanted this. Interestingly enough, this actually shipped. I could not find one in the United States this actually shipped from, um, possibly from Malaysia. Anyway, this is nice. So this gives you like actually a quick instruction on how to use it, which obviously you can go reverse and forward. And if, again, if you're applying pressure, 
going in reverse, it'll it, it picks up the pressure and will just drive the screw out. And um, is there a power? Oh, there is a power. Okay, so here's. Oh, there's a power button. There we go. So there is a power button on it and the switch going forward or go backwards. And then of course, strength and weak. I mean, they made it basically it's three, it's three things. You've got power, you got in out, and then you've got the, um, I, I mean, I'm gonna call it torque, you know, your control for how, how long the screw is, how, how hard the wood is, whatever you're running into that you need to get that in. Particularly if you're just taking parts off the one wheel. And this is why I wanted this because it has this very sensitive on, on the um, not stripping the, um, the um, bolts that are part of the one wheel. I really wanted to be sensitive about that. Sometimes with the hand, it's so easy to strip one. You know, you're just cranking it, you're loosening it up and it just slips. So um, I really wanted to make sure that I was doing my best to uh, take care of that. Oh, there's something else in here. Oh, so you get the full owner's manual. Oh, so this actually comes with it and there's a lot more detail in there. Much more, much better explanation than what's on that back of that box. And I'm gonna probably read through this because I, I do wanna understand the different settings and how I can make the best use of it. So anyway, I actually, the price point, now again on the price point on this, I wanna say this was a, maybe 150 bucks or 100, 150 bucks, which is, again, you can use a regular screwdriver. You do not need this. You really do not need this. This is like, um, ex this was what my, my grandma, grandmother would call extremely excessive and unnecessary. So I just wanted, and actually for house stuff, I wanted to have this. I just love it because it doesn't take up a bunch of space. You know, it's not like a big drill sitting somewhere. I can throw this in a drawer and it's ready to go. And again, I was watching video demonstrations of guys using this and they were like pounding in two inch screws through multiple boards, which is like this little tiny thing. I mean, look at the one wheel. It carries my body weight, it carries body weight and it carries you up a hill. It's pretty impressive what electronics are doing today. So I'll just say that in terms of size and power. So that's the Bosch Pro Professional Cordless Screwdriver, the handheld. Again, it's called the Go, and I know it's called the Go because it's like you just grab it on the go. All right, guys, that's it for the Bosch. I do have more things to open, which I'm going to do right after this. So feel free to keep on watching. Otherwise, I'll catch you another time. Thanks.